Hi, my name is Dr. Khalil Masoodi and I'm founder of Kashmir Biotech Private Limited. I'll be pitching about our anti-cancer functional food, the magic food Texo that we have scientifically designed and tested. A problem we are dealing here uh, is prostate cancer. Prostate cancer is the second leading cause of cancer-related deaths in men and primarily diagnosed cancer in men. Drugs in the market cease to function after treatment in most of the cases and become uh, cancer-related in prostate cancer, which is most dangerous and it metastasizes to bone and eventually uh, a painful death. As, Ten years ago, prostate cancer was 10th diagnosed cancer in men in India, but now it's the third diagnosed cancer in men. So the proposed solution is we have identified an underutilized plant in Kashmir Valley, which has high anti-prostate cancer activity. Further, we designed anti-cancer functional food, we call the magic food Texo. Magic food is scientifically and clinically proven to be effective against prostate cancer, BPH and LUTs, that's benign prostatic hyperplasia and uh, lower urinary tract symptoms. We found out that Texo kills prostate cancer cells in uh, vitro and in vivo. Uh, we got the central FSSI approval and there is already a recommended allowance of 4 grams and uh, after that we gave it under 100 patients through IU and uh, we found out to be effective against prostate cancer, BPH and LUTs. So the novelty of the solution is that it uh, magic food diary targets receptor. Uh, this receptor is the key gene in prostate cancer progression and here you can see on the right side uh, if we uh, green fluorescent tag the receptor, we see it's primarily in the uh, cytoplasm, but in presence of male hormone DHT, it goes in the nucleus. Uh, while as castration resistant prostate cancer, this receptor goes in the nucleus in absence of DHT, okay, what we call as androgen independent localization of uh, receptor. Once in the nucleus, it proliferates all the genes uh, involved in prostate cancer progression and uh, these genes are not turned off. There's uncontrolled growth of prostate cancer cells. Magic food is safe, non-toxic, and has zero side effects. Uh, raw material is uh, freely available. In the lower panel, you can see that uh, the rationale we use here that we want to abrogate the nuclear locus of AR into the back into the cytoplasm, what we see here. We, we touched around 25,000 extracts from two 400 medicinal plants and found out that uh, around 16 hits and one of them was Taxo. So Texo could abrogate nuclear glucose of AR, as you can see here, while as the MDB3100 has a later target market against prostate cancer, it does abrogate the AR, but not that to that extent. So the proof of concept uh, is that it uh, targets uh, endocrine receptor, decreases PSA levels, and that down regulates endocrine responsive genes. These endocrine responsive genes are responsible for growth and proliferation of prostate cancer cells, and Texo down regulates them. These are PSA, AL2, AF2, CAL reticulin. And magic food also decreases cellular proliferation, as you can see here in the calling formation unit assay. And it also decreases the invasiveness of the prostate cancer or the migration of prostate cancer cells, as you can see here. Uh, so it prevents spread of uh, cancer. And magic food decreases tumor volume significantly, as you can see here. And it doubles the life expectancy in newer mice. So this is our clinical data. So magic food resolves symptoms of prostate cancer, BPH and LUTs like uh, painful urination, incontinence, difficulty in urination, uh, weak or interrupted uh, urine flow. Uh, you have to put uh, strain uh, to empty the bladder. All these symptoms we saw resolved in seven to 10 days of taking our magic food. The differentiation of the proposed solution is that magic food is target specific as a target under receptor as we have discussed earlier uh, without any uh, off target effects. Magic food is natural, safe, and non-toxic. Magic food is cheap and publicly acceptable since there is a shift towards herbal medicine and nutraceuticals. And magic food can be used with other treatments as well. Many patients that were on chemotherapy or uh, allopathic medicine saw added benefits in terms of resolution of symptoms using our magic food. So this is our team. Uh, I have a MSc and PhD in biotechnology and a postdoc from USA in which I did drug discovery against prostate cancer. Arkib uh, just completed a master's in biotechnology along with Inam and both are doing the R&D. Uh, Dr. Anleep is a PhD chemistry. Is our Marie Curie. She does all the uh, chemistry uh, structure related experiments. Uh, Azman works on distribution, marketing, website designing, online promotions. And we have three advisors. Dr. Afsal Kalam is a BUMS and MD. He works with the Ministry of Ayush. And he is handling our clinical trials and handled our clinical trials so far. Uh, and uh, Navid Hamid is our business advisor. And Dr. Tawid, Tawid Amin is a food scientist that will look after the product development. We have already filed the patent with the Indian Patent Office. And currently, we are responding to the FER. Our technology readiness level is TRL3. And uh, we have we uh, will be shortly filing the US patent to protect our IP. Our market is huge. Uh, India, Australia, USA, Europe have the largest prostate cancer and BPH and LUTs cases, and population that are high, are at high risk of getting prostate cancer, like Africa. 
so in India, prostate cancer is it uh, was ten diagnosed cancer like ten years ago, but now it's the third diagnosed cancer in men, and there will be an increase in one forty percent in prostate cancer patients in the next two years, and mostly seen in metropolitan cities. Uh, about market. Uh, Traction: The global prostate cancer market will be 27 um, US uh, billion dollar by 2032, and in Asia Pacific, uh, India and India uh, will witness the fastest compound annual growth rate of 11.4% from 2022 to 2030, and that will be around 7.8 billion US dollars. Global functional food market uh, forecast will be around 340 US billion dollars by 2024. Indian functional food market is about 5.6 billion US dollars currently. So our product is working wonders in prostate cancer, BPH, and large patients, and uh, people are seeing beneficial effects and resolution of symptoms in seven to ten doses. And uh, some, these are some of the representative testimonials on the right side here. And going forward, uh, we'll be providing and designing range of safe, non-toxic, plant-based, anti-prostate cancer, futuristic functional foods. The foods will be popular and specific. We'll be working on refinement of MVP. Uh, for Indian market, we already have the FSSI. So we'll not have any trouble in marketing in India. We'll penetrate the uh, foreign market with the help of Biorec after getting FDA approval. So these are the milestones. The first six months will be utilized in setting up the facility and structural elucidation of lead molecule, eventually development of a range of different products. The second phase will be utilized in validation and certification. And the third phase of the grant shall be utilized in capturing niche market in India. This is our business model. We'll be targeting B2B, B2C. Uh, we have created a network of dealers and doctors who have already validated our products and uh, they are willing to uh, recommend our product to the patients. Uh, we'll be launching um, a range of products online, on online platforms as well. So we have already signed an MOU with an Malaysian company. They have tested our product, validated our product, and they are willing to market our product in the Asia Pacific. This is a three-year roadmap. Uh, so in the first year, primarily, we have to set up the facility and recruit staff. We'll be focusing on development of the range of products in uh, the first year of the project. And the second year will be utilized in feasibility studies and we will target domestic market initially, work on scale up and investor identification. The third year shall be utilized in regulatory clearances for our export and commercialization of the product in global market. This is our work plan for the 18 months. This is the budget. And we have not uh, received any funding yet for our startup. And uh, this is the list of 10 patents we have filed so far in the last four years, and two of them have already been granted. Four of these patents are associated with the current work. And thank you for your time, and I'm happy to take any questions.